Hello, I really want to thank you for stopping by once again. This is Santos on Next Level Consulting. I know that your time is very, very valuable, and uh, I just I appreciate you as a person. I really appreciate your time and, and you as a person. And and as I share these uh, thoughts here on a short video today, as I was thinking earlier, every time I get into my inspiration chamber, I begin to think thoughts and uh, you know I, I really I it's I don't know for some reason this morning I just want to share this with you um, I really appreciate you for taking time to invest in yourself because that's what you're doing I believe when you watch my videos you're investing in yourself you're looking for ways to change and you're looking for maybe some inspiration and hope you know I've been able to change my life drastically I've been able to to uh, to just radically change my life and I'm so so grateful to God for that and you know like the person on the airplane when the cabin pressure drops you've got an airplane full of people the cabin pressure drops those masks if you've ever been on an airplane, those masks drop down and you're told in the videos or the demonstrations by the stewardess that before you can help somebody else put on their own mask, you have to be able to put on yours first. And I, I feel that way. I feel that I've put on my mask. Now, I'm still working on myself. I, I work on myself every single day, you know. I. I'm a servant. I consider myself a servant, but I have to step out in faith and share my story, share my hopes, share my dreams and my values with other people because, you know, that's what I'm about. That That's, that's where my passion and that's where my love is to help people. And I've got so many things inside of me that I want to share with, with people. I'm trying to get the right angle here so that you're... Wow, the sun's not really blaring in, in the background. I apologize for that. I should be able to get something going here. And, uh, wow, I'm in, front, I'm in front of somebody's driveway. Okay, here we go. We're moving along. Bear with me here now. And uh, we'll get this video going in the right way. And uh, I hope that this message that I'm sharing this morning will inspire you to think about your life and your family and where you want to go in life. You know, most people today, I say most people are living a quiet life of desperation. They're living, they're leading a quiet life of desperation and they're very proudful. They don't want to reach out and ask for help like I've had to do. And they're stuck. You know, most people are stuck and, and it's a sad state of affairs I know because I've been there you know we we can't we can't continue doing the same thing over and over and expect a different result and unfortunately a lot of people are in that state they're waiting for something to happen they're waiting for the lottery they're buying lottery tickets they're waiting for a hand down from maybe a family member that's getting ready to pass pass away or they're waiting for something to change at their job you know, maybe their business is not going as well as planned and they're waiting for more customers just to pop in through the doors. Or maybe, you know, they're a multi-level marketer and they're not really working on themselves, but they're trying to reach out to other people to build their network marketing business. And, you know, I'm really cautious about network marketing today because I've been involved in quite a few of them. And I've learned something about multi-level marketing. In fact, I probably will be sharing some of that in other videos. But here's what I really want to share with you today. That in order for us to help other people, in order for us to create change or to see change around us, we have to be that change. We have to absolutely be that change that we want to create or we want to see. And... You know, again, I, as I've mentioned, most people today are living quiet lives of desperation. They're hoping, they're, they're praying that, that something, you know, 
be outside of themselves will take place to get them to the next level. And life just doesn't work that way. You know, it just doesn't work that way. As I've mentioned in some of my other videos, we have to discipline ourselves. We got to become comfortable with the uncomfortable. We got to be willing to step out of our comfort zone. And just for that little bit that we step out and we begin to change, it makes a huge difference. I remember listening to Anthony Robbins one time talking about his golf training. He was on the golf uh, field or he was on a course, golf course, with a friend of his and he was doing really bad. He was he was just doing really bad and, and he got upset with his coach and his trainer and, and he blamed him for his efforts because he wasn't hitting the ball very well. Well, his trainer turned to him and said, you know, basically, all you got to do is basically just move just just a, a small small percentage just shift on how you're hitting the ball and it's going to make a huge difference that little ball uh, just a little bit of a shift and that ball's going to go in the direction that you want it to go i remember listening to that statement being made by anthony robbins and you know I, I'm pretty radical about myself and I do a lot of great things with my life. I spend a lot of time by myself. I'm at that point where, you know, I'm really reaching out to help people, to share with people and to serve people. Maybe I should eliminate that word help out of my vocabulary. But I have to start somewhere and that had to start within me. And I'm very grateful. I'm very grateful today for everything that I have and everything that I don't have and where I'm going and the people that I'm going to attract and that I am attracting into my life. You know, I've noticed I didn't have very good friends, but today I have a few that I'm attracting to myself and it does work. There is such a thing as the law of attraction. If you make yourself a better person, if you make yourself likable, if you change your thought patterns, if you change the way you speak, you will begin to attract certain types of people because you're going to reach out to those kinds of people and they'll be interested in what you have to say or the way you live and the way you are. So don't lead a quiet life of desperation. You know, if you need to make a change, make a decision you know watch some videos read some books turn the tv off you know start writing down the person that you want to become on a piece of paper and look at that look at the p person you know you write down the person that you want to become exactly tailor it to you you write that person you look at that and you start thinking about that person every single day so with that said, I want to thank you for your time. I know I've made this video just a little bit lengthy. I want to thank you for your time investing in yourself. And once again, this is Santos here on Next Level Consulting. I will see you on my next video. Have a glorious or make it a super fantastic, terrific, over-the-top Tuesday. Once again, comment on my video below and I will see you on my next one.